Odds for a 50 basis point rate cut from the Fed have been all but priced out following last week's robust U.S. jobs report. Financial markets have responded accordingly with the U.S. dollar rallying and stocks coming under a little pressure. But now that the market has taken time to react, the big question will be if we have already seen the extent of the market reaction and if investors will get right back to pushing for more rate cuts than less while also looking for a healthy outlook for the U.S. economy. Already on Tuesday, we are seeing evidence of such flow, but it'll take more time to determine if this is indeed the case. Moving on, it's worth highlighting some relative weakness in the Australian dollar today, this after the RBA minutes surprised with a less hawkish tone after it was revealed the central bank is considering the potential for both raising rates and lowering the cash target. Looking ahead, key standouts on the calendar for the remainder of the day come from German industrial production, Canada trade, U.S. trade, and some Fed speak. That's all for now.